Hi guys, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to create your own merchandise using Photoshop. You may have a design in your head, but you don't have to make it. And in today's video, I'm going to show you how to. If you're not subscribed, please consider subscribing because it helps me out a lot. And yeah, without further ado, let's get into the video. So, you want to create your own merchandise. You have a design in your head and you don't know how to create it in Photoshop. Well, the first thing you have to do is have an idea. If you don't have an idea, just start drawing on a sketchbook or start using Photoshop to see what things attract you the most. For example, I have this picture of an astronaut and the first thing that comes to mind to me is adding some planets in the background. So that's what I'm going to do right now. I've got one, two, three and four. And I'm going to arrange them in a way that looks good. I'm going to make the astronaut a bit bigger, put him in the front of the picture and I'm going to make the planets smaller as well. Now what we're going to do is I'm going to merge all the planets together selecting all of them and right clicking and click pressing on merge layers. This is going to create a layer with all of the planets together. Now I'm also going to select the astronaut and this is what you want to do in while creating your merchandise. A cool effect to do is go in on image, go on adjustments and go on curves. Now you want to mess around with this a bit and make it darker or until you find something that you're happy with. I think this looks pretty good. And also in adjustments, turn the saturation all the way down. Make it black and white. And the last thing you want to do is go on brightness and contrast and turn the contrast all the way up and brightness mess around how you want it to look like. Something like this I think looks pretty decent. Now on the image I've got before with the planets I'm gonna do the same thing as I've done with the astronaut. I'm gonna go on image adjustments and I'm gonna go in curves and I'm doing the same thing. Just adjusting the exposure and light as like I want it to. I'm going to make it darker so it looks the same as the astronaut. And well, this is my design. I just took not even three minutes to do. It's not very creative at all, but it does the job for, to show you as an example. Now I'm going to merge the background with the astronaut and make them into one layer. Now I'm going to leave in the description this. This is a template to use when you want to put your design onto a t-shirt. It's free to download so don't worry about it. And one thing you have to keep in mind is that if you're going to use in images from the internet you're going to make sure that they are ro royalty free or at least give the artist credit when you're using it. The best thing to do is creating your own artwork because then you avoid legal issues. And yeah, once this is one I've done before but I'm going to drag my design onto the t-shirt as so and I'm going to adjust it and adjust it. I'm going to place it right in the middle and quite centered as well. Go on here yeah, and click on lighting colour. This is going to make the image look like it's printed onto the t-shirt. And yeah, this is one example. Here I've got another example that I've done. It's the same concept, is using an image, crop it out, go on image, adjustment and on curves, mess around with the exposure and the lights to make a vintage style effect and in black and white. As I said before, please try not to use images from internet if you're going to sell the t-shirts because I'm not going to sell what I've done. If you're gonna sell your merchandise, make sure that you're the one that created the image or created the artwork. I hope this gave you an idea. I hope this gave you an idea of how to create merchandise. I know it's not an in-depth tutorial, but it gives you an idea, it gives you a basic idea on how to create merchandise. And yeah, this is the video. Thanks for watching, guys, and see you in the next one.